In just about two hours, you will have something to see mm -hmm. over the skies in Florida. A SpaceX rocket is scheduled to blast off from the Space Coast. It will hopefully clear the way for the homecoming of two stranded astronauts. Mark Strassman joins us from the Caddy Space Center. Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams' space odyssey is almost over. In just a few hours, their replacements will climb aboard a SpaceX Crew Dragon for a 10-hour flight to the International Space Station. Veteran NASA astronaut Anne McLean is the mission's commander. Joining her are crewmates from the United States, Japan, and Russia. Wilmore and Williams have been at the space station since June. Their stay was extended after their ride home, a Boeing Starliner spacecraft, developed propulsion problems during its test flight. NASA decided to return Starliner empty and keep Wilmore and Williams at the ISS. President Trump and SpaceX founder Elon Musk have claimed Wilmore and Williams were abandoned for months in space by the Biden administration. Musk said he offered to bring the pair home sooner, but NASA says that was never considered as a viable option. Wilmore and Williams have said they don't feel abandoned or stuck in space. That is just part of the job. If tonight's launch goes off as expected, Wilmore and Williams could begin their overdue trip home as soon as Sunday aboard a SpaceX Crew Dragon appropriately named Freedom. Mark Strassman, CBS News at the Kennedy Space Center. And the Starliner spacecraft will blast off in the Kennedy Space Center at 748 tonight.